As college students head back to school, a group of Senate Democrats, including Senator Richard Blumenthal, investigating what they call alarming reports of mishandled student loan transfers. News 8's Natasha Lubchenko has a look at what this means for students and how lawmakers are hoping to fix the issue. Natasha, good morning. Laura Keith, good morning to you. Well, lawmakers are calling these, quote, botched student loan transfers a major issue for student loan borrowers. They're saying some of those issues include excessive billing and even lower credit scores. We're finding that loan servicers who received millions of student loan accounts have been adding to the burden of student debt. Now, in a series of letters to CEOs last week, lawmakers launched an inquiry into the student loan transfers from the Higher Education Loan Authority of the state of Missouri, otherwise known as Mahela, Nelnet, as well as well-known credit reporting agency Experian. Those letters signed by Senators Elizabeth Warren, Jeffrey Merkley, Ron Wyden, and Richard Blumenthal. Since last fall, we are told at least 1.4 million duplicate student loan records have appeared on borrowers' credit scores because of a glitch. And as I mentioned, lawmakers say it's leading to excessive billing, lower credit scores, and it is impacting now borrowers' ability to buy a car or home or further their education. News 8 did reach, uh, <clears throat> did reach out to Experian, Nelnet, and Mahela for comment on this investigation. Both Nelnet and Mahela tell us they, quote, share borrowers' concern and frustration. Nelnet went on to say that the Department of Education acknowledged the credit reporting errors were not the faults of the servicers. Experian at this time has not reached back out. Now, when it comes to the amount of students that have been affected, we are not sure at this time, but lawmakers uh, are encouraging people to check their credit report. Coming up in the next half hour, we'll hear uh, from lawmakers once again about what they are planning to do to hopefully correct this problem. In New Haven this morning, I'm Natasha Lubchenko. Back to you guys.